Hello, and welcome back to Tech by Pike. Today, we got a crazy video. We are looking at the ROG Spatha by Asus. Pretty big box. There's a lot going on in here. Let's get into it. This is the ROG Spatha mouse. I really like the design of it and it looks very sleek, but it is a very heavy and large mouse. The accessory container is pretty sweet. I like that it's zip up and it holds a lot of accessories for this guy. Inside the box, we find the charging display stand, cords for both the stand and the mouse if you want it to be wired, and some fun little stickers. The stand for this thing is solid, and this mouse sticks to it with magnets, so it's not going anywhere while charging. The mouse itself has 12 programmable buttons, 8200 DPI, and 2000 Hz USB pulling rate while it's wired, which means the mouse reports its position 2000 times per second. So that is some accurate clicking while gaming. I do find the mouse pretty heavy, and it is very big. It is pretty awkward to get used to, at least for me. I had a hard time trying to just wrap my hand around it. Me personally, I do not think this would be my go-to mouse every day. But I do feel like the build is nice, and if someone with larger hands were to use it, I think it would be right up their alley. It is very sturdy as well. This mouse is a brick. I think one of my biggest complaints about it though is just the layout of the buttons on the side. The six on the left side of the mouse where your thumb is, they just feel kind of awkward and it feels hard to push with your thumb. And then my other complaint would just, it's a very heavy mouse. I mean, I understand that it's sturdy, but maybe if they were to make it out of something else, um, some other material just to make it a tiny bit lighter, it might be nice. But this mouse is large and it is four a large-handed person. This mouse doesn't light up too much, but the lights around the buttons are pretty cool. I really did 
feel myself having a hard time moving this giant mouse around while gaming. I felt like my clicks were pretty accurate, but the mouse itself, it just didn't drag across my uh, mouse pad like my normal go-to mouse does. It's just, it's heavy. Killed him. Oh my god, dude, he's Just huge. so we all know, he wasn't huge. It was an NPC. He had no loot. Thank you, everyone, for all the love that we've been getting on the channel. And don't forget to like and subscribe.